Deep beneath the skin of Spain, in the womb-dark silence of Altamira Cave, a bison charges across stone, and its blood-red coat still burns as fiercely as the day it was born 40,000 years ago. This is no ordinary pigment. Hematite, forged in Earth's fiery youth, was ground into powder, mixed with water and cave bear fat, then breathed onto the wall by artists who understood eternity better than we do. While modern paints fade in decades, this prehistoric ochre laughs at time. Its iron oxide crystals lock color so perfectly that ultraviolet light, moisture, and millennia barely scratch it. These were not random doodles. The painters used the cave's natural bulges to give the bison three-dimensional life, torchlight flickering across the herd as if they were thundering through the stone. They chose the most acoustically perfect chambers where echoes made the animals seem to roar. Tell me, when you stand before something that outlived empires, ice ages, and every human who ever saw it fresh, doesn't your own heartbeat feel suddenly fragile? Today, the same unbreakable red stains the walls of caves from Indonesia to France, proof that the first modern minds already knew how to speak forever. Chronicles of the Curious Earth, where curiosity becomes cinema.